Download this code and get free GPT-40 from CodeGive.com, link in the description below. Reading files from the src main resources directory in a Java project is a common task, especially when you're dealing with configuration files, properties files, or any other type of resource that your application needs at runtime. In a typical Maven or Gradle project structure, the src main resources directory is where you place such files, and they will be included in your class path when you build your application. Here's a step-by-step -step guide on how to read a file from the src main resources directory in Java, along with a code example. Hashtag 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 step 1, set up your project structure. First, ensure your project has the following structure. Hashtag 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 step 2, create a sample file. Create a file named sample.txt inside the src main resources directory and add some sample text to it. Hashtag 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 step 3, write Java code to read the file. Now, you can write Java code to read this file. The code can use the get class, dot get resource as stream, method to access resources from the class path. Here's an example of how to read the contents of sample.txt. Hashtag 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 step 4, build and run your application. 1. If you are using Maven, you can run the following command in your project directory to compile and run the application. If you're using an IDE like IntelliJ IDEA or Eclipse, simply run the main class directly. 2. You should see the output from the sample.txt file printed to the console. Hashtag 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 explanation of the code. Get class loader, dot get resource as stream, file name. This method retrieves the resource as a stream. The resource path is relative to the class path. Buffered reader and input stream reader, these classes are used to read text from the input stream efficiently. Try with resources, this ensures that the buffered reader is closed automatically, preventing resource leaks. Hashtag 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 additional notes. If you are using Spring or any other framework, the method of accessing resources may differ slightly, but the above approach will work in standard Java applications. Always handle potential I.O. exceptions when reading files to manage any errors that may occur during file access. This tutorial should give you a solid understanding of how to read files from the src main resources directory in a Java project.